Welcome to the first part of video tutorials on WebHarvey. In this tutorial, we will show you how WebHarvey can be configured to get details like business name, address, phone number, etc. from a yellow pages listings page. Data extraction from websites using WebHarvey involves two stages, a configuration stage and a mining stage. In the configuration stage, we teach WebHarvey how to get data and in the mining stage, WebHarvey automatically gets the required data based on the configuration which we create. So let's get started. The first step is to load the page from which you need to extract data within WebHarvey's browser. For this you can click links, perform search etc. The inbuilt browser of WebHarvey is just like any other browser like Chrome or IE. Once you have loaded the page displaying the data which you need to extract, click the Start Config Toolbar button to start the configuration process. Once you start configuration, the next step is to select the required data. Selecting data to be scraped is very easy using WebRV. Just click on any text which you need to extract and that's it. It's very easy. WebRV will automatically identify patterns of data occurring within web pages. So when you select the first listings address, all remaining addresses are intelligently extracted. If you need to include more text than what is included in the preview, you can click the capture more content button in the capture window. You can access this button either from the quick access toolbar here or by clicking the more options button. You can apply this option as many times as required and finally click the capture text button. You can also capture URLs and email addresses using WebHarvey. Click on the link whose address you need to capture and select the capture target URL option from the capture window. Now listing pages such as these often spans over multiple pages. WebHarvey can automatically load all these pages and extract data. For this, we need to select and set the next page link. Scroll down the page and click on the link which loads the next page. You can click either on the next page link or the direct link to load page number 2. Click on the link and select set as next page link option from the capture window. Now you have configured WebHarvey to automatically scrape the selected data from all pages. If required, you can follow each listing link to load its details page and select more data. For this, click on the title link of the first listing and select follow this link option from the capture window. Wait for the new page to load. Once loaded, you can click and select additional details. When the data which you need to extract occur always after a heading text, it is recommended that you use the capture following text method. For this, instead of clicking directly on the data which you need to extract, click on the heading before it and select the capture following text icon from the quick access toolbar or from under more options. Once you have selected all required data, you can stop the configuration process by clicking the stop config button. You can now optionally save the configuration so that it can be run later.
a saved configuration can also be scheduled or edited to make changes. To start mining using the configuration we just created, click the Start Mine button. This will bring up the Miner window. Here you can specify the number of pages to mine or just click Mine All Pages. Click the Start button to start mining. Now Web Harvey will start mining data and the data mined will appear in the data table in the Miner window. Once you finish mining, the mined data can be saved in a variety of formats. Formats like CSV, TSV, XML and JSON are supported. You can also export the captured data directly to an SQL database. We hope you find the first part of this tutorial useful. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact our support. Thank you.